Alright, okay, so. Uh, spot is in. Okay, so hey everyone back home. Um, right now I'm going to take you on a little tour of my Takamas and my home. So this is how I live in Armenia. This is um, basically what I do every single day. I come home, sometimes buy an ice cream if it, they're selling it, and then we go this way. So, um, this is my Takamas. A Takamas is kind of like an apartment complex. And, um, as you can see, it was built, you know, Soviet era. And I live in that one right up there. I'm on the fourth floor. Um, all the kids love me, so maybe we'll run into some of, some of them on the way. But if you want this, loving, shurakalitim. To the left here are, um, concrete slabs that have probably been sitting there. I was told that they used to be like somebody's old garage and they've just been sitting here for probably 20 or more years. And then we can continue this way. This little thing right here, I have no idea what it used to be. It looks like it may, might have been a swimming pool though. Or maybe like a community garden, I'm not quite sure. But So it's trash now, unfortunately. And then, over here, those are our trash cans that are like in sort of like a cement wall. And there's a lot of little kitty cats. And this little structure here, a guy keeps a whole bunch of birds in there, like 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 pigeons for, I guess just for fun, I'm not sure. Shall we go to my house now? Right here is our little haunting. If you need anything, you just kind of jump down the stairs and you can buy it at the store. It's pretty convenient. I'm going to get in and try and get the neighbors to it today. What is this? Should I keep filming? Uh, okay. Can you see anything? Yeah. Okay. Alright, so we're going to walk up to the stairs right now and um, so right now I'm on the first floor and then we'll, I'll meet you on the, floor, on the fourth floor. Hey everyone, we're at my door, so welcome to the fourth floor. And here we go. We meet a couple of kitty cats. So, here's the entranceway where my kitty cats have their litter boxes. And then uh, uh, right here, my punching bag, my bathroom, and come on in. <laughs> Gotta do the Armenian thing take off the shoes and, and you know, put on some slippers here in a minute so you don't Marcel. Okay, awesome. Okay, so first I'm going to show you a little tour of my bathroom. Alright, so the bathroom's actually probably the worst part in the house because it wasn't remodeled. Um, and as you can see, it is complete with a washboard because I do my laundry by hand and it sucks. Worst chore ever. And my toilet with a falling off toilet seat. And the best thing is you'll notice there's like no tank behind the toilet. That's because I bucket flush. So, reuse the bathroom, take a bucket, take some water out of the water bucket, dip in, wash the toilet. Not too hard, but you know, see a little unmodern, I guess. And the toilet paper, this stuff's actually the good stuff. Um, it's pretty soft, it's not made of tree bark like the other stuff. And <laughs> so, um, yeah, I don't really know what else to tell you about. Um, the bathroom, except today is a really good day because the light is actually working. Um, and then, oh yeah, here's my water tank right here. This is something you probably wouldn't find in the States. It's 400 liters, and today the water didn't come on, so I don't have any, but I don't have very much water in there. It's only up to there right now. But usually I can shower with about a third of it or something. So it's pretty good. Not bad. I'm pretty happy with it. 
The drain here, I have to be really careful, I can't let any water go down the drain because if the water goes down the drain, then my neighbor downstairs comes up and she starts screaming at me because there's water coming in on her ceiling and whatever. Blah, blah, blah. And then here is my kitchen. So these are my trash bags, my sink. So if you ever want to complain about not having enough kitchen space, just remember that this is all the kitchen space I have. It's okay. I can deal with it. Not bad. I got used to it. I have my cutting board. And this, I want to see how you, you, how you, light, a, how you light the stove here in Armenia. But you need matches. And then you need your fingers to turn on the gas right here. Get as close to it through this. So this. And then like that. Voila. Okay, and the best part of the entire kitchen, actually no, this is the second best part. This right here is my one temperature burns all oven. This is like a homemade oven. So my landlord gave this to me when I asked him if he had an oven. And this thing, I don't know how hot it gets, but I actually, I put, a, I put a, an oven thermometer in there and it went to 400 degrees, actually let me look, how hot does it get? I don't know what my thermometer is, but it went to like, um, like I think around 600 degrees Fahrenheit, um, and it couldn't go any hotter. So uh, it probably gets a lot hotter than that though, because I actually um, last week I tried to I tried to roast some peanuts in here, and they turned into lumps of coal in under three minutes. So I'm pretty sure that it's hotter than 600 degrees. It might be around a thousand. And then come on out here. All right, so I actually forgot to show you the best thing in my kitchen. By far, it is my shelf. See my shelf? This thing, I didn't have this for like several months. And my kitchen was a disaster because I had nowhere to put anything. And I have to show you, number one, vanilla extract, a bottle of Armenian cognac, and a couple end of vanilla bean in there. Awesome. And, oh, this is Catherine's, by the way. I kind of forgot to give it back to her. <laughs> Catherine. Um, but, okay, so, there's no, never a single Armenian house, including an American Armenian, or American house in Armenia, without at least, at least, two types of tea. Most have, like, seven or eight. Black currant. Something you can't get in the state, I don't think. Maybe you can. I don't know. Um, right. Whatever. Best part of the whole thing? My spice cabinet. Oh yes. You can thank my I can thank my mother for this because my meals have been so much more delicious since she sent it. Coriander, turmeric, oregano, nutmeg, sage, etc. etc. It's awesome. And a variety of other things like Trader Joe's big chocolate. Silicone baking things or muffin tins, muffin things, whatever. Um, curry, pesto, rum extract, my little hugging salt and pepper shakers. Mm. Pretty awesome. Best part in the whole kitchen, guarantee it. Okay, so, alright, kitchen's done. And then, come on out here, I'll show you my balcony. This. Alright, so I'm sorting through some boxes right now. It's a little messy. But out here, this part of my tapa moss. So that's outside. I'll show you. Yeah, like, yeah you can see that's what the apartment looks like. Next door. And I've got some storage here, some storage up here. And I have a refrigerator. It's pretty cool. Can I see? So, my refrigerator. This is a luxury in Armenia. In fact, it's actually fairly well stocked today. Cool stuff. Very well stocked. And then potatoes. You can never go a day in Armenia without a potato, ever. And a dutmink, or I don't remember the, uh, the Russian word for it, but it's a uh, dutmink. Um, and this is the good pasta. The good pasta. Um, yeah, you know, lentils off on that. These are uh, hemp seeds. They're delicious. Delicious. So come on this way. And welcome to my living room. Slash bedroom. 
this is probably where I spend like 90% of my time. Uh, on <laughs> this is where I spend like 100% of my time right here on my little laptop. This is a USB flash drive or a flash mo or a USB modem, and that's how I connect to the internet. In the US, you probably don't see those too much. Um, but yeah, that's how I connect. And here's my my Batuhan over here. Batuhan, Batuhan. Tea from Turkey. Um, and some cool stuff like that. And then over here is my kitty cat. This is Hike. Say hi, Hike. Say hi. Hello. Hello. Can kiss? Because no. <laughs> She's like, I want to kiss you. You smell like tomatoes and cucumbers. Um, and yes, this is my bed. This is pretty amazing before I keep my clothes. Bookshelf up here. And I can I, best thought, this is the best thing. Right now it's raining. Um, five minutes ago it was not raining, and in five minutes it'll probably be sunny again. But this is my taco moss. Actually, let's look outside. So. Probably the best. This is my neighbor down there, going into his little car note. In the gardens. No children outside playing right now, though. There's usually little kiddos outside. So, that's it. That's Savan, Savan Armenia, in my Takamas. Yeresun, this is Nalbandian Yeresun Inna. 39 Nalbandian. So, Verge, so.